Actually, what I'm going to talk about first is our air handler water heater combination. Uh, we've actually de designed an interface module so that you can take a tankless water heater and connect it to an air handler. Okay, and in that air handler, you put a hot water coil. So now you have a water heater that's supplying water to a coil, and a blower is going to blow the heat out of that coil for you. So you can take a water heater and turn it into a furnace, essentially. So here we have a Renai tankless water heater. We have various models. I'd be glad to talk to you about those after, the, uh, after this presentation. Just come on into the booth. And here we have a blower unit. Okay, now a blower unit can be ordered with air conditioning. It can be ordered with a hot water coil. Then you can connect it to a Renai tankless now. Because what we did was we designed an interface kit that allows you to do that. It's called the DPS. The way it works is you turn up a thermostat. The first thing that happens is a circulator pump is going to turn on. It's going to start to circulate water through the tankless unit. Okay, now the circulator is inside the cabinet here, but it can be outside the cabinet in either one of these lines, depending on the situation. When that happens, the Renai unit detects flow, turns on, starts heating water. Okay, water goes into the coil. When the coil is hot, the DPS unit senses that and turns on the fan. Now, uh, it starts to blow hot air, and of course there would be a ductwork system off the top of that. Okay, it wouldn't just blow blow out of a box like that. You'd have ducts that go through your house. <clears throat> if you wanted to put a cooling coil on there, you could put the cooling coil on top, and in the summertime, it doubles as AC. So this is a device that you go to your HV HVAC guy with. Say, hey, you're putting in my carrier units. I want you to connect the, the Renai water heater to give me my heat. I don't want a heat pump or I don't want a gas furnace. I want one unit to do both. That's what this does. Okay, so if somebody jumps in the shower now while the unit's blowing heat, here's your uh, tempering valve. It starts to go to the shower. The unit will detect an abundance of flow. Okay, it knows the flow going through here, but now all of a sudden it sees more flow. It says, hey, that's the shower running. So if that flow exceeds a certain rate, we shut off the blower. Okay, that's, that's the trick to this whole thing. You can't run both. You might be able to, but if you open two or three showers, eventually you're going to hit your limit. One of them's got to shut off. You don't want to shut your shower off. You don't want a cold shower, right? So you got to shut off the heat. So 10 minutes, the blower shuts off, you're done your shower, it goes back to heating. Okay, so you, you rarely notice the dropout in the heating circuit. But that's what this device does. And it can be used with any of our Renai tankless units, our, our, our luxury, our value, um, all the units.